Hi everybody, I'm Nick. Thanks so much for joining me on my channel once again. Today we have something that I'm a little nervous to do. In my last video, I promised that I would eat something weird and it's time to pay the piper. So today I will be eating these guys. Zoo Meds Can O Crickets. Ideal for reptiles, birds, and fishing. I hate all three of those things. I'm just kidding, I don't hate reptiles. I've had three different pet lizards in my entire life. And my sister had a bird once, but I can hated that bird. Chirp, chirp, chirp. All day and night, until one day it just fell over dead. Birds. 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 Can you hear them rattling around in there? Dead bugs. Dead bugs. Dead bugs make the rattling sound now. These are not the kind of crickets that you see online that you can bake with and are meant for human consumption. No, these are more meant to feed a turtle. Specifically, a turtle named Nintendo. Nintendo belongs to my friend Skylar and his kids, Harry and Juliet. Thank you, all of you, for letting me borrow your can of crickets. And also special thanks to Nintendo for sharing your food with me. Anything you want to say to the people? Also, I would like to dedicate a moment of silence to Nintendo's late sister, or at least tank mate. Her name was Gwen Stefani. I have a photo. Oh, Gwen, you were not long for this world, but you will be truly missed. She was such a little, beautiful, petite little turtle, and she would always sit up on her rock like that. She ain't no hollerback girl. She ain't no hollerback girl. All the girls that be like this. You turn been around that trap to a I'm really just stalling. I don't want to eat these crickets. Gwen, this is for you. Oh. Uh. Oh. They smell like actual barnyard dirt. M mm, disease. You smell like a disease. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. One just fell out. I hate these. Just a pungent, earthy smell that I cannot deal with. There's the whole gang. I don't know if this is cheating, but I have uh, black coffee here to help cleanse my palate after. Again, I'm not sure if that's against the rules, but your rules. If you smelled these things, you would beg for death. I can't even touch them, really. Let's get a good one. <laughs> I'm a little on edge. That was my laundry timer. Apparently I thought it was a cricket springing to life to attack me. Mm, they have full body parts, like full limbs and grabbing at me. Uh, okay. There's one. Here we go. Oh! 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 It's in my teeth. <laughs> oh, this is so undignified. Oh. Oh. oh, that was nasty. Oh my God, I did not expect it to be that bad. It's still in my teeth. It's like the husk of it just instantly burst open in the moist dust of like manure and peat moss exploded into my mouth and the shards and the shreds of it got stuck between my teeth and all of the colors turned brown in my eyes and then you were all so far away and I heard screaming and I think my grandmother called me from the grave. It was not good. The taste of it and the smell of it worked together to give me trauma. This I'm out. <laughs> I will never do that again, anything like that. I don't care if they're worms or bugs, we're done with it. Maybe I can be convinced. It depends on if you give me a thumbs up or not. Give me your suggestions of something else weird you'd like to see me eat. But I don't know, maybe like a wacky candy from Germany. Maybe not so much like things you pull out of the grass. Although I'll probably do whatever the f you tell me to anyway, to be honest. <laughs> Ugh. Birds. Birds. Let me know in the comments below if you've ever had any crickets before. Did you react to them like I did? Maybe it's because they're pet food crickets and they're meant to taste disgusting. And if you've never seen me before in your life, I hope you'll click that subscribe button, which is my face over here, or that button down below. Thank you so much for watching. I've had so much fun eating something nasty with you. You guys are the greatest. I hope you have a great week. I'll see you on Friday with a toy commercial commentary. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.